So, Hannah Galt. Um, we are related, by the way. <laughs> so, uh, Hannah is my daughter. Uh, this is not your first time in a baptismal pool. That's, that's right. So, so tell us a little bit about that. Like over the last couple of months, you had some questions from mom and I, and um, just talk about, talk about that a little bit. So I was, I grew up in a Christian home, obviously, but um, I, I got baptized like when I was 10, and I just really don't know if I was saved, because I really don't think I was, because although my outwardly appearance was like, I was saved, I feel like my internal appearance wasn't as much, like, I was just living, like, kind of very sinful life just in my brain and, like, just, like, when my parents weren't around and stuff, and I just, like, don't feel like I actually, like, really cared about God, it was just, like, you know, this is just what I do because this is just what I do it, and, and then I just, I, like, kind of around when my grandpa died, um, I just, like, I don't know, I don't know. I came to a really close relationship with Christ, and I feel like that's when I actually like came to Christ versus when I was like younger. I'm not for sure either way, but yeah. But you were sort of going through the motions before and doing what mom and dad wanted you to do, but in terms of really trusting the Lord at different points in your life, you didn't really have an experience of that and, until later. And so looking back, um, you don't really think that you were a tr truly a believer when you were in the baptismal waters the last time. So, and uh, we, you know, we talked about this over a period of weeks, and uh, she, we talked, about, in fact, we talked a little bit about it last week, and she came to me this morning, and she said, well, Dad, is it, is it too late for me to get baptized today? And uh, long story short, I said no, but Tell, tell when, when she asked me that question, I said, okay, well, so you thought about this. Why is it that you want to be baptized? And what did you tell me? I told them because I, I kind of, I re actually was reading online about this, but I read that it was one of God's, like, commands to be, like, baptized as a Christian, and I wanted to fulfill that. Okay. So. so. Hmm. Anna, because of your profession of faith in Christ, it's my privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right, let me, let me close this in a word of prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you again for this time and for these testimonies and for the way that you have worked supernaturally in each one of our lives, uh, revealing the truth to us, giving us new life, changing us. Uh, we pray that you would continue that work in Hannah's life and in Trevor's life and in all our lives, and that we might be a testimony to the, the glory of Christ we pray these things all in his name. Amen.